Proof the end times are here. One of the key indicators of the end times is the increasing prevalence of people turning away from faith and following teachings of demonic influences. Satan actively blinds people's minds, preventing them from understanding the gospel. The rise in demonic activity in various societal institutions and cultural expressions like music and entertainment. These manifestations are tangible evidence of a spiritual battle unfolding. Demonic influences are becoming increasingly overt in modern culture. During the early stages of the tribulation, a period of trials following the rapture, unbelievers will be lulled into a deceptive sense of peace and safety. Nonetheless, this era of tranquility is anticipated to be transitory and deceptive. In Daniel 9.27, the scriptures reference a peace treaty, signifying an agreement brokered by the Antichrist only to be violated midway through the tribulation period. This corresponds to the biblical storyline wherein Israel is expected to feel a semblance of safety and peace as the day of the Lord commences. This phase of calmness will be interrupted as the tribulation events unfold, exposing the short-lived and misleading character of the peace accord. The rise to power of the Antichrist will be characterized by his presentation as a peacemaker, a charismatic leader emerging amidst the tumult of worldwide upheaval. He will offer solutions to the world's problems, seducing many with promises of stability and harmony. The deceptive sense of security provided by the Antichrist will eventually result in more significant devastation, given that his rule will be marked by oppression and dishonesty. 